Alright, today we're going to be messing with the timing. So, I'm not even going to mess with trying to like fiddle around with it. So, if you don't know, this is adjustable. So, there's not really a way to line it up anymore. Plus, I took it all apart. So, you know what? We're not even going to worry about that. There is a good thing about that, however. You can still kind of use the markings and get pretty dang close. Um, dependent on. So, as you can see, it's going to be real hard for you guys to see inside of there, but cylinder one looks like it's about at top dead center. About. But, you know, we can't really be sure until we, like, stick a bolt in it. That's too small of a bolt. Let's get a bigger bolt. Man, I'm running out of random parts to just throw in this. Let's see here. Stand by, I want to find something long to stick in there. <laughs> well, that might work. Yeah, that'll work for sure. So that's where the piston's at. Piston number two. Look at that. So, piston number one. We're gonna use a. We're gonna use this today. That's, I think that's what we'll use to time this, buddy. So, common house to household tools. Um. So what I went ahead and done is. On your motor, there's two things. There could be this little dot which is for mine, my camshaft, and it could be something that kind of looks like this down here, but it'll be like right here or something that you're supposed to line up. So, mine's a little dot that I just put right there. So that's what I'm gonna do. Also, while I'm doing that, I'm gonna turn the motor and see what happens to this. If I somehow timed it perfectly, that would be pretty cool, but I doubt it because I definitely fiddled things around. Look, it's going down now. So, it's definitely off now. But, what I want to do is line this up just perfectly. Then we're gonna undo these. It's a star bit. It's torqued on there pretty dang, pretty dang good in the camshaft. So I had to get the snap on out. I'm using a T30 